Andy. Today I'm going to be taking a little look at Tiburon rum. Now Tiburon rum, a lot of people that know their rums are going to know it's the shark rum. And Tiburon in Spanish means shark. And I've been lucky enough to meet the uh, main man behind this rum a couple of times at different rum festivals. And his name is Basil Di Stefano. And I must admit, one thing I really like um, about um, Tiburon is that Basil gets out there himself with his family members more often than not promoting his products and he's there on the front line and I like that. Um, it's always come across as a real gentleman and um, he found this rum while scuba diving in Belize. F knew he was onto a, a great product and he couldn't get it back in Chicago where he was from so he... Um, he ended up getting into the rum business and he's now the head on show at Tiburon Rum. And uh, like I said, gets out there on the front line promoting the products, which is always a great thing. Um, Tiburon is produced from molasses uh, at the Travellers Distillery uh, in, near the Caribbean coast of Belize. And it is Tiburon is column distilled, column distilled. And it's a blend of rums uh, with different ages and character which then get recasked in uh, ex-Kentucky bourbon casks for a second maturation. Uh, the end result is a blend between uh, four to eight years, but due to US law, you can only claim the four year age limit because it's the youngest rum in the bottle. Um, the bottle itself is so distinctive. I've had people say to me, you know, have you ever tried that rum from Belize? And I say, which one? You know, you know the shark rum and straight away, yeah, Tiburon. Uh, it's quite distinctive. The bottle itself comes quite a long, tall bottle. I like that. Uh, what I really love about it is it's tactile. If you've got big hands like me, you can grab the bottle and pour yourself a glass easily with the bottle itself. Or otherwise, you've got a three-fingered pull neck, which is quite easy to pull. Quite a bit of fork gone into the bottle, and I like the bottle. Um, in the back, if you have a look, it's the shark rum, and you can see that shark shining through the back there. It really is distinctive and you also get a little shark pendant on there as well which is another little added touch but um, yeah it, you know like I said Tiburon is the Spanish word for shark and it really is a great bit of packaging uh, the the color of this rum if I got a little bit of a glass pour here if you look at this it's a pale straw color really is sort of quite pale and a strawy color the nose I poured a glass, so I'm going to little little, little smell. My first impressions on the nose, you get a very mild intensity of molasses, which lead to a melicate, mellowing oak aroma that just seems to play really contently in the background. Um, on It then releases little notes of vanilla, oodles of cinnamon, so much that if you were to close your eyes you can imagine yourself being stood over a hot tray of cinnamon buns it really is quite oodles of cinnamon in there um, and then you get a wonderful tannic earthiness from the oak um, which is quite alluring uh, quite nice indeed on taste very smooth on entry Just a tantalising little bit of sweetness there to ease you into it. Quite light, oily mouthfeel. Which steadily builds with tannic oak, it really does. Mellow in tannic oak. It's quite, quite enjoyable. Um, you then, when you swirl it around... Have another sip and it releases vanilla. Um, obviously, oodles of cinnamon on the nose. You get a nice bit of cinnamon on the on, on the palate as well. Um, caramel in there as well. And light orange preserve. Um, it really has got a little light orangey element in it as well. It's really, really nice. Um, the finish on this rum. Very cordial, 
um, spicy, peppery fade on the finish, leaving you a little bit of a tingle. It's really nice and drying. It's, it's a quite a very pleasant rum. Um, I would say packaged well, certainly worth a go. I would certainly say give it a try. My name is Andy. This has been my little look at Tiburon Rum, the shark rum. And until next time, enjoy.